Unravel the mystery of puzzle mats in English. Hello, English enthusiasts. Welcome to our channel, where we unlock the meanings of English phrases and words. Today, we are going to explore the phrase, puzzle mat. Whether you're furnishing a playroom or just curious about this term, you're in the right place. So, let's dive in and piece together the meaning of puzzle mat. A puzzle mat is a soft surface made up of interlocking pieces, much like a jigsaw puzzle. It is often used to provide a safe and comfortable area for children to play on or to protect floors from damage. The mats are usually made of foam and can be easily assembled and dismantled. They are versatile and come in various sizes, colors, and themes. Puzzle mats aren't just for children. They serve multiple purposes. They are ideal for exercise areas, where they provide a cushioned surface for workouts or yoga. In educational settings, puzzle mats can be learning tools themselves, with numbers or letters that help with basic math or reading skills. For others, puzzle mats make for a cozy flooring option in leisure spaces like game rooms or home gyms. The term Puzzle indicates something that requires a solution or fits together with other pieces to form a whole. A mat, on the other hand, refers to a piece of fabric or other material placed on a floor for comfort or protection. Combining these, a puzzle mat suggests a mat that is assembled from pieces, fitting together to serve its purpose. Understanding the phrase Puzzle mat also involves knowing related vocabulary. Let's look at some related terms. Interlocking, connecting together firmly in a locked position. Foam, a soft material used in making puzzle mats, known for its cushioning properties. Dismantle, to take apart a structure. By learning these words, you can deepen your understanding of puzzle mats and improve your English vocabulary in a practical context. While we don't use phonetic transcriptions, here are some tips to pronounce puzzle mat correctly. Puzzle, the ZZ, sounds like the ZZ in pizza, and the L is like the L in angel. Mat, the A sounds like the A in cat, and the T is a crisp sound, as in tap. I hope you've enjoyed assembling the meaning of puzzle mat with us. Remember, language learning is like piecing together a puzzle. Every new word or phrase adds to the big picture. Keep practicing, and don't hesitate to replay this video to reinforce what you've learned. Until next time, keep learning and keep curious.